expect from uh, the event a great uh, improvement in the economic situation of Egypt. I'm uh, very optimistic about this event. شكرا جزيلا شكرا جزيلا With full confidence that their efforts and your participation will make up this meeting our encounter a landmark on the march of the new Egypt towards a better future. Egypt has laid down a sustainable development plan that is long term until 2030, which aims at the building of a new and modern democratic society. I am really pleased to announce that the investment authorities in my country, Kuwait, will direct four billion US dollars. Kingdom of Saudi Arabia will submit a bundle of assistance in the form of four billion US dollars. I would like to announce additional support by United Arab Emirates to the Arab Republic of Egypt with a total four billion US dollars. We would like to express our solidarity of the Palestinian people to the people of Egypt and to the country of Egypt in its war against terrorism. The American people are committed to the security and political and economic well-being of the Egyptian people. And we will work with you. Well, this morning when I got up and I saw the sun rise over Egypt, and I was probably one of the first ones to swim in the pristine water of the Red Sea, I know we can swim together. I think we have an incredible past, but I'm sure we have an incredible future, and together we'll build. Thank you so much, Mr. President. So he's asking, he's asking. This giant project that we are going to present will be an important part and will play an important role in attracting many international and local investments. Egypt at a very cross point, historical moment that God gave us a leader who has a vision and a people who has the will. We have to respect this opportunity and to work day and night to our beloved country. I wish you all the best. Have a pleasant stay in Egypt. May God protect Egypt. People. If you don't have a powerful science and education, in a given country, you cannot be on the front. It is a pleasure for me to find a large number of investors from Saudi Arabia partaking part in this meeting. I know how important it is to the Egyptian people and we're not going to let you down. We, we, we need to uh, execute on this project. So. Egypt is going when it comes to size of economy, population base. Uh, I guess, you know, it's, it is on its way to be the, the most important 20 economy in the world. One is institutionalizing implementation, making it the DNA of the institutions that don't just serve a privileged few, but serve the population as a whole. We need to build a new system. We have to get rid of uh, the existing bureaucratic system. The most difficult thing about government is taking the great idea and turning it into reality. When 20 million people take to the streets, that is democracy. The fate of Egypt is very much the fate of the region. Stable Egypt means a stable region.
I would like to once again reiterate the extreme importance of further mobilization of private sector windows in your distinguished institutions. President Abdel Fattah Sisi has said during the meeting of the UN General Assembly that the new Suez Canal is the gift of Egypt to the whole world. Egypt deserves the best. They have to apply policies of inclusion to bring in Sharia compliant funds. We need to include youth, we need to include women, we need to include disabled, and this happens through uh, SME support. This administration is very much committed because there is a strong belief that without inclusion there is no growth. I would like to define in innovation in a different way. Innovation doesn't happen without taking risk. Together with the loudest voice that you have. One, two, three. Go, Go Egypt! Go Egypt! And allow me, I will not speak without having my youth uh, that participated in this effort to proceed to the podium. Egypt needs less than 200, 300 billion US dollars to build Egypt. This is the figure. I know the problems and challenges of Egypt, and I know the solutions. Egypt needs not less than 200 to 300 billion US dollars in order to give a real hope to the 90 million people to work and to enjoy and to live. تحيا مصر السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته وشكرا جزيلا لكم